Well, howdy folks. Welcome back to my channel. I got an unboxing video for you today. And you know, I've been doing these unboxing videos for a while. I've got a playlist with, with all of them and they go back quite a ways. But uh, today I'm working with a new company. I haven't worked with them before. Their name is Mirio, M-I-R-I-O. And they make a lot of different stuff. And they reached out to me and asked if I wanted to um, review some of their products. So this is the first thing they sent me. And I'm gonna go ahead and get it open. This should be one of their new electric kalimbas. So I'm excited to uh, check this out here. Let's go ahead and get the box open. And voila, we see the Mirio logo right there. And this is the kalimba. All right, so let's see here if there's a model number. B08WWTN6YX is the model number. Boy, that rolls off the tongue, doesn't it? All right. So let's go ahead and get this baby open and we see a case in there. And then it looks like we got some more stuff in here. We got a little tuning hammer. This is common on a lot of the uh, kalimbas that you'll find. And then a, uh, looks like a soft carry bag as well. I'm gonna set that box down. And then we've got a hard case here, or it's kind of a, I don't know if I'd call it a hard case, but it's kind of a rigid case maybe is the right word. The zipper on the case is fairly small tooth. I'm not sure if you can see that. So. Um, I don't think that's necessarily a, a negative thing, but did want to point that out. And ooh, here we go. We got some more accessories. Looks like we got some little fingertip protectors. I'm not even sure exactly what those do, but oh, that's just taking a dive on me. I'll set those down. We've got an instruction manual here. Oh, it looks like there's some more stuff inside of that. Oh, yep. Yeah. We've got the familiar uh, tine stickers and uh, cleaning cloth that you get with most of the kalimba kits. And then we've got uh, a little how to play guide here and looks like it tells a little about it and has some songs in here and tells you how to put the stickers on and all that stuff we've got some songs here at the end i'm not sure how well that's going to show up but anyway so a little book there and it looks like we've got a cable as well this is a standard quarter inch cable set that down and then we've got the kalimba okay so you might notice this is a 21 key kalimba it is not a 17 key kalimba all the previous kalimbas that i've reviewed on my channel have been 17 keys so this one has a few extra notes um you can see just real quick we've got the mirio nameplate right down there it's etched into or burned into the wood here we've got some little designs and the sound hole seems to be in the shape of like a stag's head there and um we can see inside the box it has that uh, model number again i'm not going to read that off again but um we've got the model number there along with the mirio logo on the bottom we've got the the familiar two holes um, across the back, we've got, you can see the support bar here, and then uh, the metal uh, piece that the tines go ac across. So um, pretty standard on that. And then we see down here, we've got um, a jack. Okay, one thing I noticed that's kind of different than the 17 key kalimbas, this is actually in the key of C, but the lowest note is an F. Okay, so we go an F, a G, an A, a B, and then a C. So C is, the what fifth lowest note so um you've got basically a lot of range below your root as well whereas on many of them the c is the lowest note so that's kind of interesting and then we go all the way up to the d above but as is typical on a lot of these um kalimbas these square box kalimbas as you get towards the edge of the box here there's not much soundboard to resonate so typically the tines that are out towards the outside don't have a whole lot of resonance which is true on this kalimba as well. And that's not specific to this kalimba, that's basically all hollow box kalimbas. Um, whereas on the flatboard kalimbas, typically they'll be a little more even across the tines. But let's go ahead and play something and hear what this baby sounds like. Okay, so that gives you a little idea about the acoustic tone, but guess what? It's electric, we gotta plug this baby in. So let's give that a shot.
Okay, so there you have it, folks. That was the Mirio 21 Key Electric Kalimba. And this is the coffee finish. They also have a blue finish as well, um, if you like that kind of thing. But you can get these on Amazon and probably a few other retailers as well. So pretty inexpensive, pretty decent little Kalimba. And I really love the fact that it's got the jack so you can plug it in, because I do love to plug things in. So there you go. And if you like this sort of content, why don't you go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. I will see you guys in the next video.